Well, hello guys. Welcome to a brand new Let's Play of Let's Play Uncharted 2 Among Thieves. And, uh, no, this is not a blind Let's Play. This is just a, a regular Let's Play. I promised you guys that I would be uh, moving on up the uh, series, start from Uncharted 1 to Uncharted 3. That's what I intend to do, so we're going to continue on with Uncharted 2 Among Thieves. So, uh, I guess we'll do, uh, chapters, right? And I'll be playing this on normal like everything else. And, uh, yeah, let's, let's do this, so. So, uh, yeah, I'm glad I'm doing this again, so uh, this will be fun, I guess, so. This is my favorite of the uh, Uncharted series, the second Uncharted. I love this one the most, so. I just love the fact that the uh, story was a bit more intense and very character-driven and everything. You know, it was really awesome that way. And uh, I, I do love the characters, and we get to meet Chloe for the first time. Very, very sexy Chloe. And uh, I do love her a lot. And, uh, yeah, and the graphics are just awesome, and it, it's really fun. I, I like it, and the, uh, the gunfights, I think, is the best in this one, so. Here we go. My man, my man. Hey, Nate, good to see you again. Oh. Oh. Oh, God. That's my blood. That's my blood. It's a lot of my blood. <laughs> yeah, now we can see that. Oh. Oh. Oh, God. Nate, get out of there, dude. Nate. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, this is starting to turn out to be a lousy day, huh, everyone? I guess we'll make our way around here. Hey. Just make our way through here, around, and climb up here. So, yeah. I mean, look how intense that situation is. Oh. Uh-oh. Oh! Yeah. All right. So yeah, this one is my favorite one in the whole series. I do love the second one a lot, so... The one problem I probably would complain about is the fact that, uh... Ugh, that, uh... What's his name again? Oh! Is that, uh, Sully's not in this one. Well, he is in this one, but... He doesn't really th appear that often. Y you'll, you'll see, so... Oh, God. Oh! Oh, no, 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 no! <laughs> Jesus. Alright, just swing it. There we go. Alright. Alright. And we'll slowly make our way up this lovely train wreck. Uh, could you imagine what the announcer would be saying right now? Everyone, please stay in your seats and just pray to God that you don't die or something like that. I don't know. Oh! I would just go ahead and go up here slowly. Uh, oof. Oof. Keep going right down here, so you know. So yeah, what was really surprising about Uncharted 2 was like quite a big juggernaut to the whole series that so many people started liking it, you know. Oh. Oh. Oof. Which is kind of surprising because like. Even the first Uncharted game was really good, so I don't know why people started liking it on the second one, so... Probably because of a bit of everything else, so I know. I'm a very big fan of the series, as you guys know. Oh! Climb up! Climb up! Oh! Get up! Get up, Nate! Oh! Oh, crap. Run, Nate! 
Run, 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 Whew. Well, that was close. So yeah, quite an intro, huh, everyone? Man, look at those graphics. Even back then, they were still pretty damn good. I was really happy when I heard that the uh, game won Best Game of the Year for 2010, I believe. Buy me a drink, sailor. Or was it 2009? Harry Flynn? Hey! What the hell are you doing here? I'm looking for you, mate. Uh-oh. Should I be flattered or worried? Maybe a bit of both. I love Flynn's uh, Come here. accent. I've got a job for us. Really? A client is willing to part with a huge sum of cash if we acquire a certain object for him. Right, I'm listening. Now, you're not going to like this. Oh, no. No, you're out of your mind. Yeah, you just, just hear me out for no, a second. Flynn, we both know two people who were killed trying to lift something out of this and place. And one who made it out. Yeah, barely. I can't do this without you, Drake. You're the only one who's cracked it, and you know better than anyone it's a two-person job. No, no, no. Three, actually. Right. And speak of the devil, here she comes now. Hello, hello. What? Chloe Fraser. Nate. Drake. Nathan. Drake. <laughs> Nate Drake. Hello, Harry. Chloe here's one of the best drivers in the business. Mm -hmm. She'll take good care of us. I, I bet. bet she will. Right, look. I've got it all figured out. We go in through the sewer. I'm loving it so far. <laughs> that puts us in the courtyard. From there, we scale up the wall, run across the rooftops, and just drop down into the exhibit hall. Bob's your uncle. Bob's your uncle. And what <laughs> worth all this trouble, I hear you ask? I didn't, but go ahead. <laughs> but that's it. An oil lamp. Yeah. <laughs> it's worthless. I don't get it. Neither do we. That's why we tracked you down. Well, it sounds like you're working for a nutcase. Hmm. Some collector who's got too much time and money on his hands. And by the way, this is not worth any of it. But there's more. How's your 13th century Latin, mate? Ah, uh, not so good. Or for me, at least. Where'd you get this? Borrowed it. From the files of the nutcase. <laughs> In Trebizond, we were set upon by thieves. Father, Maffeo, and I were robbed of our greatest treasures. This was written by Marco Polo. Sweet. Yes, that much we were able to work out. Unfortunately, the rest of it's nonsense. Hey, hold on. So that it should not fall into the wrong hands, I concealed my great sorrow in the unlikeliest place. The light of the great Khan shelters the fate of the Thirteen. See what I mean? It's just gibberish. He's talking about the lost fleet. Yeah. yeah. I don't know, someone want to fill me in? Marco Polo leaves China with 600 passengers and 14 ships loaded down with treasure from Kublai Khan. And he lands in Persia a year and a half later with only one ship left and only 18 passengers. Mysterious. Now, he recorded every detail of his journey, but he never told what happened to all those ships and the passengers. So, so somewhere out there, there are 13 ships loaded with the Emperor's treasure waiting to be found. Yeah, and that is what your client is after. Mm -hmm. hey, look at this lamp. It's covered in Mongolian script. It must have been a gift from Kublai Khan. The light of the great Khan shelters the, the fate of, of the 13. 13. Marco Polo hid something inside this lamp. Something that pinpoints the site of the lost fleet. Nice. Nice, Sorry. nice, nice. We're dicking this guy over, right? <laughs> dicking. <laughs> you in then? What the hell? I mean, what could possibly go wrong? <laughs> <laughs> oh, what could possibly go wrong? Everything. <laughs> <laughs> Chloe said dicking. <laughs> oh, I'm so mature, aren't I? Uh, ignore me, folks. I'm just an idiot. What do I know? I don't know nothing right here. Oh. Okay, that does not look good. Ah! And why am I heading into this place of great wreckage? Right, okay. 
Now what? Now what, 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 what? I guess we head to here. Oh! Oh man. One thing I love the, that I notice a lot is that, like, if you notice on uh, Drake's hair, it's all snowy and everything. I mean, that's that's really sweet detail right there that you can get with this kind of game, so, you know. I really appreciate for what uh, Naughty Dog put in, uh, the effort that Naughty Dog put in uh, to this game. I mean, they did a great job. It's awesome. Oh. Of course it's locked. It's always locked. Yep, so we unlock it. Just like that. Easy, Nate. Don't want to hurt your hand now. So we'll keep going. R2 to reload. Just like in the last game. One thing I was really happy... Oh! He's alive! Oh. Karma's a bitch. <laughs> One thing I was really happy about is the uh, the fact that you can the blind firing while running around. I thought that was a good improvement to the game. Oh. And uh, as you will see, they also improved with the grenades too. It's I was really happy for that because in the first one, uh, you guys saw how frustrating it was for me to get to pass a few parts. Not to mention that uh, killing the bad guys is a lot easier too. Well, it's, I wouldn't say easier, because if I say easier, it just sounds like it's too easy. I mean, like, it, it's more fair now. It doesn't take huge amounts of ammo to actually take them down, which is just completely annoying and unfair. So, thank God for that. And, uh, yeah. Oh! Oh! Oh. That don't look good. Oh, Jesus. Ow. Oh, ow. Oh, oh. Wow. He's gonna feel that one in the morning. Or at night. Or whatever. Hello. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh, Nate! What are you well, doing? So much you for sly dog, you! You mind telling me what the hell is going on? You mean with Flynn? Yeah, you might have warned me. And missed the look on your face. <laughs> anyway, you haven't exactly made yourself easy to find. Talk about making yourself easy. Oh, Ooh. you're not jealous. <laughs> Let's not forget who walked out on whom. After all, you don't get to be jealous. What? If it what? makes you feel any better, whoa, my whoa, relationship with Flynn is strictly whoa. professional. Whoa. Really? Mostly professional. Oh. <laughs> when I figured Ooh. out he was actually Ooh. onto something, Ooh. I thought you'd want to be in Ooh. on the action. Ooh. Yeah, yeah. So <laughs> what's the plan? Just like we said, mm -hmm. we pull the heist. We find the ships and we make off with the treasure. Mm hmm. With Flynn. Mm hmm. And then? And then we split the take three ways <laughs> and you and I just disappear. Nice. Together this time. I see. Ah, oh, lucky bastard. Until then, he can't know about us. He's gonna be pissed. Yeah. He's gonna be fine. Mm -hmm. Trust me. Oh. Lucky bastard. That lucky bastard. Drake, you sly dog, you. So, um... Yeah. Nathan Drake isn't that much of an ordinary man, is he, after all? He is a character with some flaws, and though, I mean, you don't really see the flaws... At least I don't think so in any of the cutscenes. It's more like actually in the gameplay, which you actually see some of his flaws, which I like a lot actually, because it makes you feel like you're actually experiencing the flaws. You'll notice from time to time he will actually trip on something, which kind of shows how clumsy it is. He is at fall at uh, running or or other things or some such. His uh, techniques in fighting also is kind of brawling, like oh, 